Rich here with the Geek Awakens. I'm here with Karen Ashley. You may recognize her as the Yellow Power Ranger, Aisha Campbell. Karen, how's your con going? It's going great. I love coming to Chicago. It's one of my favorite cities, so I'm always happy when I'm here. Yeah. Uh, so we're coming up on 30 years of Power Rangers. Crazy. I know, right? <laughs> When you joined the cast, did you have any idea that it would still be so big today? No. I was telling them earlier, I was like, I literally remember about 13 years ago, Jason Frank and Steve Cardenas called me and said, hey, come with us. We're going to do a Comic-Con. And I was like, what is that? And they were like, the fans, they want to meet us. And I go, do they remember who we are? And they were like, of course they do. And 13 years later, here we are, still talking about Power Rangers. So for us, for I never thought we'd still be talking about it 30 years later. It's yeah. crazy. It's, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, in you know, and speaking of Steve and Jason, you yes. know, like they've you've got so many you know like classic Rangers making cameos and everything like that. Absolutely. I know you did uh, Power Rangers Hyperforce a couple did, years ago, yes. but like, is there? ever a chance that we might see Aisha Campbell again? You know what? I honestly think the powers that be, they don't like Aisha. <laughs> like, and I don't say that like haphazardly, but honestly, they ask me every two years. And then when it comes to us actually like working out a contract, they go, never mind, we're not going to use you. So I'm kind of like, yeah, it's happened like four years, every two years. So I'm like, I'm over them. I would love to do it for the fans, but I don't know that they even care to have me, which yeah. is honesty. I have to be yeah. honest. I, so I don't think I'll ever be back. Which, which that's just crazy. Cause like it's we crazy. were, we were talking earlier today and like Aisha, like she was such a badass. They don't, I don't think they appreciate black girl magic. Like it was the sassiest of the sassiest. And I think the fans would love it. I think, you know, there's opportunity for them to kind of get the band back together at some point. And I just know the fan, that's all they've asked for, for 30 years. Yeah. Ever since we all left the show, every single con, all they ever asked for, will we ever all be together? So hopefully one day you guys out there, right Hasbro, Tell them you want the band back. Tell them you want Aisha. And yeah. maybe one day if you guys really demand it, it'll happen. There you go. <laughs> so, you know, like, like we said, like, you are an inspiration to so many people. Yeah. Who inspires you? You know what? I've always been inspired by just strong women. I, I have five sisters. I, my mom was a single mom. I mean, it's just like I've always been like one of those people who've always been surrounded by women who just go for it. Mm -hmm. um, but if we're talking celebrities, I mean... Everyone inspires me. I'm like one of the biggest fangirls. Like literally, I love everything. I love everybody. I'm obsessed with Stranger Things. I'm obsessed with superheroes. So I love everybody in Marvel. But I especially love all the women in Marvel because oh, I yeah. really love how they give them the opportunity. And I feel like Power Rangers kind of got that party started. Like we were girl power before it was girl power. 100%. So for me, I'm just like... When I see these big movies now, I just, I'm, I'm the biggest fan. I'm just sitting there loving it all. Thanks. So I got one more question for yes. you. Uh, you're also a part of The Bop, which yes. is the official podcast for The Blurred. What's this podcast about? How can people uh, find it? You can find us on YouTube. You can find us on Instagram. It's called The Bop, The Blurred Official Podcast. And it's called, we're black nerds, but we're, you know, we talk about everything that's nerdy. And we literally, like, we, last week we were talking about Stranger Things. I think we're talking about it again this week because we saw the finale and we're all dying <laughs> and we talk about every single movie every single like we go to different cons and talk about the, our experiences there and we're just you know trying to get a community who embraces themselves and just embraces their nerddom and just says you know what I'm going to love the things I love unapologetically so and I think in the black community a lot of us we don't freely become blurts so we're trying to push everybody over the edge and say come on to the dark side it's safe here <laughs> i love it i love it karen thank you so much for You're taking the time so to talk welcome. to us have a great rest of the con of course yeah. thank you guys <laughs> it's morphin time <laughs>